Live pictures of Gaza, just about 3 a.m. there, a couple of hours of darkness left before the Israelis lose the advantage uh, as their invasion will begin, their counter-invasion. Hamas killed more than 300 Israelis when they crossed the border this morning and took dozens hostages. Uh, Josh Hantman is joining us from Israel, former advisor to the Ministry of Defense. Josh, I keep thinking about the video of Israelis being dragged, uh, old women, uh, young women, children, babies being dragged by the Hamas gunmen back into Gaza. And the, what that must do to the Israeli psyche is something unthinkable. I think you're 100% right, Leland, and obviously, you know, you, you, you've lived here and you know that the people of Israel are a resilient people. I mean, they have uh, gone through more wars than pretty much any other nation that's, uh, you know, that's in existence today. But but today really is, is one of the blackest days uh, in, in its history. Um, and it's been a long day. It's been a tough day. Uh, and, and some of the scenes that we've seen, you know, we... we, we We've seen we've seen executions on the streets. We've seen people huddled in their basements, like the 1930s, really hiding with their children, while Jew haters knock on their doors to look which Jews they're going to to murder. Uh, and quite frankly, uh, we just never thought we would see these uh, scenes, which really are out of our worst nightmares uh, here here in Israel. And it's been a very dark day. Um, but I do believe that the people of Israel are resilient. And, uh, and, and I, I just want to—I want to read something from your Facebook page. Please share as much as you can. Hamas is holding my sister-in-law and two little nieces. They are documented in the kidnapping videos to Gaza. May the whole world see these faces and bring them back home to us. We're going to show these pictures later when we get them turned around. But I, real quick, Josh, I got 30 seconds. Help us understand. The, the shock and how this compares, say, to the Yom Kippur War, that, that Israel, th this is now an existential threat to, to watch Hamas gunmen inside cities of Israel. Yeah, I, the, you know, this, is, this really hasn't been seen since, since the War of Independence. Jewish, having Jewish communities overrun by, by terrorists, um, it, it's something that's not been seen for a long, long time. Um, and and the response, as as the prime minister has said, will be will, will be serious. And, and 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 quite frankly, I think he will have the full support of of even his his uh, biggest detractors here, uh, because yeah. what we've seen. To be, you know, this is, is this has unified this country in a way. Josh, we got to run, get some sleep. We'll talk in the next couple of days. Thank you. Uh, live pictures Thank of Gaza. We'll be right back. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.